guys welcome to the PC Tips Pro and in today's video we are going to see how to create a blog on Google Sites. So before getting into the video, if you guys haven't yet subscribed to the PC Tips Pro, please do subscribe. And now let's get into the video. So firstly we need to create a Google Site. So for that you can just uh, get to the sites.google.com and uh, you can see different templates over here or else you can just click on this plus icon to create a blank new site and you can use this templates to create a new uh, let's click on the template gallery to see all the templates and here you can see all the new templates uh, which are already uh, having some theme on them uh, on it so it's like something uh, for restaurant uh, restaurant site and this is for photo portfolio and this is for holiday party and many more templates are present you can choose one among them or else if you feel uh, if you feel like nothing will fit into your uh, if into your theme you can just go over this blank and then you can build your own your own one so once you click on it you will be taken to something like this so this is a very basic uh, google site and the, and here firstly let's give a name to our site uh, so this is a site document name uh, so let me give it as some ABC blog and then uh, your page title you can just uh, give it to be you can make it to be a welcome message welcome to some your blog you can just give it like blog and then you can even add some tagline or else you can even add some description here so here and then let's come uh, let's scroll down and let's see what to add and here let's have a quick look at what all these google sites have uh, so firstly in the insert section you, you have text box so you can by using this you can add text and using this images you can uh, add your images from the pc or else from the internet and then uh, you, you can even add your files from the drive and also you can embed some code uh, you can choose your layout of how your website should look like and you have many more options like you can add table of contents you can have buttons divider placeholders your youtube videos you can embed them and also you can add the calendars you can add some location using this map and also you can give this docs slides sheets forms charts and you can just use all of them and you can create a beautiful blog and then uh, let's also uh, see how can we firstly get started with uh, get started with uh, firstly you can just see this header type you can change it uh, to cover it looks something like this large banner looks like this banner looks like this and title only looks like this so i just find this banner is well sufficient for me so i'll choose this and even if you want other any of this you can just choose from them and here you have change image so this background image so if you want to change you can click on change image and you can upload it from your pc or else you can select them from the internet uh, like you can select from some basic gallery over here or else you can just select from uh, by URL you can just give the image URL or else you can just search, search it from Google or you can just uh, go with this live and then your albums or else you can just go to your Google Drive and you can just do it uh, you can just get it from there and let me for now go with this Google search and I want it to be something like um, let's say I want to just add some flowers so this maybe it's just a sample one just to show you how it works so this is how it uh, have added and then has added and then now let's uh, uh, go go to the next section and then just click on the text to add and again let's give this welcome to my blog so it's completely up to you have to what to mention here and what to mention here so this is my starting line i want to give or else you can just give your uh, any other text so this is how uh, i want to add and then you can adjust this 
I want to align it this like this and I want to make them in the other font you can just change your font and then you can change your font size and also you can make it text bold and then you can even change the color of this text and all you can even link it to other pages so which will be discussed in the future parts of this video and then let's scroll down and let's see uh, here you can see uh, we have I uh, have added one image and some text option so let's see how can you do it just go to the insert section and then uh, just scroll it up and then click on images and click on select so I'm selecting this because uh, I'm just I just want to show you how, how it works you can just choose it from your own PC and then let me just uh, click on Google image search and let's search for flowers and let me choose this image click on insert and you can see the similar image you can just drag uh, just to make it uh, make the size to, uh, may increase the size or decrease the size and let's say I just want to add some text let me just decrease this text and let me just drag it here Uh, so it will look something like this so here let me increase the size and here I can add my text so I just I can just uh, change this font uh, and let me just keep it to be this and also I can change the font size to this and my font text to be in this color or else let me just change this color and let me just uh, your text will look something like this so you'll be entering all your text here and then uh, if you have any YouTube video uh, that uh, you, you can just refer your visitors to visit uh, you can just do that easily by just going to this insert section and scrolling down here you can find this YouTube option click on this and paste the link of your YouTube video like this and then just search for it click on it and then just select and here you can see and you can just uh, enlarge this like this so it's all up to you I'm just doing it twice just to show you how it works and then uh, when the person visits your blog post blog site he can be able to just play this YouTube video uh, and then now this is how you can add your images, text and YouTube videos or, or even you can add your docs, slides, sheets and anything, any documents from your drive or by using this uh, buttons, uh, using these options. But make sure that those uh, files or documents are, uh, are, are off from all, this, all the restrictions like you might have been giving this restrictions like accessibility for those folders to be uh, up to only some people or uh, you can just uh, set those uh, restrictions to be only uh, visible only to you so just remove all these restrictions while you put it on your on your google sites like on your blog site so then now let's see how to add new pages to your google sites uh, to your blog site so let's click on this new page here you can give your new page um, so let's say this is some contact page click on done and then here this contact page is uh, created and even you can uh, see the sub pages you can add the sub page by just clicking on this three dots click on add sub page and you can give name of this page mm, it can be something like some a you can just uh, add this kind of pages to it I'm just using some letters because just to show you and then uh, you do you do have many other pages here you can rearrange them like this uh, let me just let me just do it like this or else you can just make one page as sub page of another like this so this is how we can just do it so let me make contact page as sub page of about us page and here in the settings you can uh, in the navigation settings you have two modes that is top mode and side mode 
in the using this top mode you can uh, you, the, uh, something which you are seeing now is the top mode and the side mode it's uh, uh, side mode is something which you can see like this you can just click on this and here you can see the side mode like this and let me just show you this drop down looks like this and then so i'm comfortable with the top mode i can just i'll just go with the top mode let me close this and this is how it looks like and even you can just um, uh, go back to the insert uh, go back to the home and then you can click on this um, text you can just link it to other pages on your site internally so i if i just wanted to link it to my abc page i'll be just clicking here and clicking on apply so once my visitor clicks on this he will be taken to the abc page or else let me say i just want it to be taken to about us page just click on this insert link and about us page apply and then once you are done with all your changes click on publish so it will be showing you the previous one and the current one uh, so, so the currently published one and the changes that we have made and click on publish click on view so this is how your blog looks like so i have done it twice just to show you how we have made this um and then you can just drop down to this and you can see different sub pages you can just go to this page this page in this way you can just navigate through the pages and this is how you can make your blog site using google sites for free so uh, this is all for this video guys i hope you found this video useful to you and like share and subscribe to the pc tips pro and thank you for watching guys